one of the most powerful verses of optimism when we're facing a calamity or a tragedy. Memorize this for Surah Tawbah. Beautiful verse. Say, Allah is telling you to say this. Allah wants you to memorize this. قُلْ لَنْ يُصِيبَنَا إِلَّا مَا كَتَبَ اللَّهُ لَنَا هُوَ مَوْلَانَا وَعَلَى اللَّهِ فَلْيَتَوَكَّلِ الْمُتَوَكِّلِ Say, nothing shall happen to us except that Allah has already decreed this for us. Do you know what Mawla means? Mawla means the one who's in charge of protecting you. That's what Mawla means. Mawla means he is in charge of your nourishment. He is in charge of your health. He is in charge of your safety. That's what Mawla means. So if Allah has planned it and he's our protector, then surely the one who is our protector will protect us and guide us and manage our way out. Learn it from the mouth of our Prophet Musa alayhi salam. When he was fleeing, the children of Israel are in the desert. The army of Fir'aun, trained soldiers on horses, archers, the whole entire nine yards, the military is there. And they're running and fleeing on foot. And they get to the Red Sea. And what do the Bani Israel say? The Bani Israel, they don't have that iman. Inna la mudrakun. Khalas, we're gone. Fir'aun's gonna catch us up. We're gonna die. What did Musa say? Memorize it and then use it. Kalla, inna ma'iya rabbi sayahdeen. I have Allah, how can I possibly lose? Allah is with me. Inna ma'iya rabbi, my Lord will find a way out for me. That's what you call optimism. He had no weapons, no army, no training, no horses. Behind them is the mightiest military force known to man. In front of them is the massive Red Sea. They don't know how to swim. They have children, they have babies. The Musa says, no, it's not gonna happen. I have Allah on my side. Allah will show me a way out. And what did Allah do? Allah showed that way out. When you believe in Allah and you put your trust in Allah, that's when the miracles happen. Every one of us, wallahi, we can, we can experience many miracles in our lives. Wallahi, as Allah is our Lord, we will face and we will see those miracles, many miracles for our personal lives. Sustenance will come from a place we never expected. Help will come from a source we never thought about. And this is the reality of lived experiences. So my brothers and sisters, learn and memorize this beautiful verse, just a single verse. Allah wants you to memorize this and Allah wants you to repeat it when you are in calamity. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will solve all your problems. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will bring you out from the problems. Allah will make a way out from you in whichever or whatever calamity you are in. The mu'minuns, the believers, they do tawakkul on Allah. They trust Allah. They make dua to Allah. They work hard. They take action. They pray. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is enough for them. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala brings ease for them from every difficulty. Learn the du'as in the Quran and ask Allah with these du'as. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will never disappoint you.